Hi, my name is Trooper Brian Neff. I'm with the Ohio State Highway Patrol. I'm out of the Cambridge Patrol Post. Today we're here with the at the Cambridge Patrol Post. We're with my office. My office is a Dodge Charger. It has a V8 Hemi in it. And in a second, we're going to show you a few of the things in the patrol car that make this my office. Everything that we do, we can pretty much do in our patrol cars. Uh, all our equipment's in the patrol cars. Pretty much everything I do, I can do with this car right here. This is a state trooper's office. In the office, we have our computer. There's everything that we have. We can do uh, all our reports. We can do everything that comes up in our job on a daily basis. We have our light bar. We have our radios. We have our radar. We have our laser. The radar and laser are used to check speeds of vehicles. We also use the laser to in, during crash investigation. We can use it for measurements of distance. Uh, it helps us to be able to do a lot of different things, not just check vehicles for speeds. Uh, in a second, what we'll do is we'll show you where we put the bad guys once we arrest them. In the event that we do have to arrest somebody, this is where they get to sit. As you can see, it's clearly not very comfortable. It's not some place that you want to come back to, but in the event that somebody is placed under arrest, this is where we're going to put them temporarily till we make it to the jail or back to the patrol post for the investigation. As I said, this is our office. This car has everything that we need so that we don't even have to come back to the patrol post. If we have to, we can stay in the car, work all day long, handle every situation. In, we have a lot of computer equipment you can see. A lot of it here all the way across the back. We have some stuff covered up that's kind of top secret stuff. We also have a lot of our stuff for crash investigation. We have our cones. We have rescue ropes. We have fire extinguishers. We have extra ammo. We have medical kits. In case we come upon something before the fire department gets there, we have medical kits. We also have another device that we use for investigating crashes. This right here, this right here is a wheel tape. We can use it to measure distances at a crash scene, but as you see, we have a little bit of everything inside of here. Uh, we can assist motorists when they break down by helping them change the tire. We have some extra equipment, not just for our cars, but other vehicles. Pretty much anything that we would ever need is in this car at all times. This message is not just for the kids, but this is mostly for the adults. Recently, we've had a lot of state troopers getting hit by cars failing to move over. We ask every time you see a patrol car, an ambulance or other vehicles on the berm with their lights on, please always think about us and our safety. Please move over to the left lane if possible. Thank you guys.